From the gridiron to the baseball diamond. Tycho Hammers has been a big threat for the Blue Devils, and so far this baseball season, he's been a nightmare for pitchers. He's been swinging the bat well for us, and uh, it's been the growth for him this year. Um, last year and early this year, you could get him out on off-speed pitches, and and he's taking advantage of the balls that they leave up and putting good swings on them. Improvement like that didn't come overnight. tyke has been practicing since the winter, something he says has helped his game. You know, I've been practicing for this for a couple months, so it's like I'm not just starting baseball right now. You know, I've, football and baseball kind of intertwine. You know, I play, I'm a receiver for football and then a, center, a left fielder for baseball, so tracking and stuff makes that really easy. Being the jack of all trades for the Blue Devils has helped him become one of the more dynamic players on the baseball team this year. And that's helping him coach up his teammates from the dugout. I'm kind of like, I guess, our hitting coach a little bit. So guys like asking, like, what am I doing if I'm leading forward and stuff? I kind of give them little tips. You know, I have a couple guys down town at CG that I go to. So learning from them, passing it down to our teammates so we win. Tyco Hammers is known for both his play on the football and baseball field. But don't ask him to pick a favorite. It, it's even. You know, I've, I've played both for a very long time. So I can't split it like that. And lucky for us, we still get to see another year of Tykel do his thing for the blue and white. Victoria Bordenga, WGM Sports, Quincy.